First up, 24-year-old Darren Shapiro. If you saw the Masters last year, you saw this guy, Masters champion in 97, looking to repeat. A guy who has won just about everything in the sport of wakeboarding. Darren is known for the incredible height that he gets off of the wake. This little ball of power can, act, can build up tremendous speed as he cuts into the wake. He gets huge air. Let's watch him as he opens up with a nice S bend. A lot of these tricks were invented by this young man. Skeezer, blindside landing. That landing, one of the most difficult in wakeboarding. Totally backwards. Beautiful 540 with a handle pass. We're seeing it all. Darren Shapiro and X Mo. One of the few guys who's ever attempted, let alone made that one in competition. Shapiro jamming a lot of tricks in another blind landing at the end of pass number one. Doug, that's called an orbital 540. Absolutely incredible. I think Darren's the only one doing it. Now let's watch Darren as he gets ready to kick off that 540. Nice looking rotation, no problem at all. And watch this orbital. Big kick off the top, starts rotating one way, kicks it back the other way, blindside landing. Gotta be tough if not impossible, but Darren makes it happen. Shapiro won the Masters the very first year in 1994 here at Callaway Gardens. He won it in 95, he won it last year. Could be a fourth in the making right now. Second pass for Darren Shapiro, and he hasn't fallen yet. Remember, he gets one credit in the bank from the judges. Well, Darren, obviously always in the running, is going after it today. He needs to put it all together if he wants to take this Masters title. Because as Tara mentioned, there's a tremendous amount of competition in the 39th Masters. Shapiro, with a complete second pass, will get an opportunity.